yeah, there's definitely fish activity. <laughs> Good morning. It's about nine, maybe a quarter after nine in the morning. I'm just getting out for a little day hike. I'm a little winded. I had to walk up a road for about 10 or 15 minutes before uh, I could get to the trail. And I'm headed up to a lake uh, that should have uh, some pretty good grayling fishing. We'll see. I was the only one in the parking lot this morning, but it is a pretty popular area. So I'm sure we'll see some people as the day uh, kind of goes on. But as you can see on my back, I got a, a few different fishing poles with me. I've got some coffee, I've got a hammock, and uh, I'm gonna relax for a bit. I have a rehydrated peak refuel meal and should be out for a few hours and hopefully we can catch a fish and just have a, have a good relaxing day. All right, total walk time from uh, the lower reservoir where I parked my truck until now is about 35 minutes. I should be to the reservoir that I'm going to in about 10 minutes, maybe 15. Trail so far has been great. Uh, a couple very, very small patches of snow, just a little bit of mud, and other than that, nice dry trail. So that's kind of appreciated. And I'm coming up on a meadow right up here, right before the lake that I always see deer, so I'm hoping uh, where it looks like I'm the first person up here this morning I might see some wildlife, but we'll see As you can see, I found a little bit of snow right beneath the uh, reservoir It is a little slick and icy, but I'm going fine without spikes, so I'll be to the lake in, you know, five minutes Well, uh, I'm up here, super, super pretty. Doesn't look like much fishing will be had here. I'm gonna go check the inlet stream and see what's going on over there. It looks open, but it's probably uh, two weeks away from being fishable up here, which is fine. I'm gonna have a little snack, maybe a cup of coffee up here and work my way back down to the lower reservoir. And uh, I'm gonna fish somewhere before this day's over, so. For now, just enjoying the hike. Really pretty over here. All right, you guys, this has got me super excited. I've been watching the inlet for about 20 minutes and there's definitely fish activity. There's actually, uh, there's a little bit of open water, so I'm gonna get my Tenkara rod out and uh, see if I can't hook into a fish. This is a, uh, this has just got me so excited, so uh, I'm going to walk over there and find a better place to stand that's not so muddy, and we'll see what happens. <laughs> oh, I love this. So that's my open pocket. Not a lot, but... Oh, boy. Okay, guys, I'm rigged up. I got a little pink midge on my Tenkara rod, and uh, we're going to see what happens. I'll probably switch rods and put some dries on my fly rod, but... Uh, this was ready to go, so it's what we're working with.
beautiful little guy. Uh, we're going to get him right back in the water. So that took two casts on a size 16 pink midge. And uh, we're going to get right back after it. That was awesome. Okay, so I've still just caught one fish. I've seen quite a few. They're just little, you know, five, six inches. Uh, I haven't seen any grayling yet, but um, they're just really spooky and I'm like right in the sunlight so they can see me and they just swim away. So I'm gonna get my lunch heating up and get my fly rod out and uh, see if I can't get a little further back and just toss a dry fly out there and let it sit. And uh, hopefully we can pick up one more before we uh, head out of here. And it's super fun regardless. So just really feels good to be out and let's get some lunch. Quick and easy today. All right, uh, I think I may have told you guys earlier, but I've got a peak refuel sweet pork and rice that I'm gonna heat up for lunch. I'm gonna have a cup of coffee. And then I'm going to uh, get a different rig out on the water. Uh, I've already been off for five minutes and they're starting to surface already. Yeah, that's what's on the uh, lunch menu. I haven't tried this one, but uh, the ones I have tried from Pete Refuel have been really good. I'm sure this will be the same. Okay, I got my coffee water uh, heating up now. It's going to take 10 or 15 minutes for my food uh, to be ready to eat. So I'm gonna get my drone up in the air and just show you guys how pretty this area up here is right now. I still haven't seen or heard anybody, which, you know, you can't beat that. <laughs> I uh, didn't have enough battery on my phone to get much drone flight, but I got a little bit, so we'll throw it in here, and uh, it's pretty up here, but my food is ready, so I'm going to have my coffee, eat, fish, then get ready to hike out of here, so good life. All right, I am packed up and going to hike out of here. One fish, and uh, of course now that I'm not down there, there, there there's a lot of activity, but that's normal. Um, there's just not a lot of real estate to work with down there and they could see me. So, should be a really quick 30-40 uh, minute hike out of here, and we will see you guys on the trail very soon.